So why is the top of a flat top flat and not round? Well, that's a good question I get quite commonly. The number one reason is safety. If you think about the arc of a prop, it's a circle. But the big danger areas on a paramotor are top left and top right. When people are warming it up, that's where they're gonna put their hands through netting into the propeller on other units. But with a flat top, notice, because the unit's flat and the top is a square, your two upright tubes are right in the most critical area where most people get their hands into the propeller. So by making that top flat, I also gave considerably more clearance right where you need it, but not in the middle where you don't need it because nobody gets uh, prop strikes in the center, top center. So it allows you to have the lowest overall cage design for easy transport, but while at the same time having the most possible clearance right where you need it. Now the next thing is think about where do your brake toggles go when you let go of them in flight? Well, if you let go of your brake toggles, they're gonna go right here. And think about most units. If it's a circle and they have slants for the bars, they have their biggest gap right in the worst area for that gap. So by making this uh, a consistent square and a simple design, it gave you an enormous amount of clearance. There's another reason. What happens when you look up? Boom, your helmet hits those stupid bars. So on units that are a circle and you see the top tube slanting to the center, well, when you look up, your helmet smacks right into those bars and it limits your ability to look up. With the flat top, you have the nice Kevlar netting behind you and it gives you extra clearance so that you have much more freedom of movement to look up. Now, another one is when you disassemble the flat top, it breaks down smaller than most other units because of the simple five-piece cage. Most units use only a three-piece cage, so those pieces are huge. But with the flat top being flat and having a five-piece cage, everything goes together very simply and strongly and while being able to break down as small as possible for shipping and transport.